second time in three months a truck got stranded in one particular spot in the Irish Channel. And residents hope this will be the last time it happens at the intersection of Laurel and 3rd Streets. Lauren Bale has more. A quiet street in the Irish Channel <laughs> has seen some chaos recently. Truck driver John Love has almost 40 years of experience, but it wasn't enough to prepare him for New Orleans roads. I've got a delivery right down the end of the street at the building supply, but there's no signs that say no through trucks. That might be a sign the city should consider. By the time I stop and pull my brake, the old tree completely snap. Resident Cosmo Marino watched it happen. It shook the ground. It, it literally shook the ground. The truck remained wedged under the tree for four hours. I'm real sorry for the people around and the time it took from the town to come out here and do it. Crews were finally able to get the truck out, but they couldn't save the tree. I mean, an old tree got torn down now. And I just hope I don't lose my job over it. But I still got a mortgage and kids to support. The intersection of 3rd and Laurel has been plagued by problems over the last few months. Two trucks have now gotten stuck on the corner and a pothole opened up that was so big residents turned it into a patio. Hey. Crews cut up the tree and the driver continued on his way. While neighbors are shocked this happened again, the truck driver is relieved the accident wasn't worse. You know, my truck can be replaced, lives can. Lauren Bale, Eyewitness News. Well, residents say they are angry that truck drivers continue to use 3rd Street as a cut through to Chapatulis, and they say they're working on getting signs that close the street, uh, the residential street, to semis.